What is going on guys? It's Unseen Gaming here and today I'm going to be showing you how to build and use a hybrid cannon on a sky base that's, that is water protected. Let's get into it. Okay, so first, one, put four blocks in a row. You want to make two stacks, well I don't know why that's there, but you're going to make two stacks of four. So, one, two, three, four, two, three, two, three, four, 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 and two, three, four. One, two, three, four, two, you're not looking there, three, and four. Now you go one, two, one, two, one, two, delete all the bows. Now you will place slabs, like so. Now you place a block of obsidian there, and you put two dispensers here and here and then you put obsidian like this like that and then you come down but first I'm going to make the barrel which you do like so now you come up and then over here you just one two one two one two one two really simple now you come over here and do however many long you want so I'm just going to do three and then two high so one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, or like so, and then you place a dispenser there, you know, there as a booster, put obsidian too high here and here, for, de for just to make it look better, I always place obsidian there and there, and for the redstone part, you put obsidian there and obsidian there, Red redstone, maybe, redstone, and then you place a comparator, and then you place redstone, redstone, redstone. Then you put repeaters on all three of these on both sides. No ticks. Then you come back here and place seven repeaters. One, two, three. And then make sure that they are all on four ticks. Now you just connect all of this. Actually, I need to move this out one more. Like so. This makes it look cleaner. So they're all on seven ticks. Come around over and connect to that. That way it will look like this. Make sure that your comparator is in the on position. Then you come back here, make a platform of three obsidian, place six pistons like so. You come out, place three repeaters on the back of these pistons, all fully ticked. So at four ticks, and you place three redstone on the back, a little obsidian stair right there. Do that, and you place nine repeaters. One, two, three, four, nine. Okay, first repeater will be at three ticks, and then all of the others will be fully ticked. Now you connect all of this through redstone, like so, and like so, and now I'm going to load it. I will be back once I have finished loading it. Alright guys, I'm back. I almost forgot to add water, so all you do is put water there. All of this is loaded, but first being a sky base that is water protected, as you can see, the first thing that you're going to have to do to be able to break through any kind of block is break this and stand, sand stack like so. So cobweb, 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 they sand as high as you want. It's going to come up to here. Just make this a little bit easier. Um, hit that. Slash slash set sand. Come here, come here. And then you're going to want to break all three of these. 
come back here, wait until it's almost all down, and then place a button that I forgot to do right there, and then fire it. All goes well, you should begin st stacking sand like so. So I will stack sand up to around the middle of the cannon, middle of the base, and then I will be back. See y'all in a minute. Alright guys, I'm back, and as you can see, I have stacked sand up to just about the middle of the base. And so now, to hybrid, in order to actually break whatever the base is made of, you, play, you replace this piece of redstone, reload the cannon, break the bottom three sand as always, take three. Wait until it's down, and then fire. All goes well. You should get a decent hybrid shot. And now, you're in the base. I'll just do another shot to show y'all that it works. Not messing around or anything. As long as it actually does work, at least. And see, made a bigger hole. So as you can see, guys, I mean, it's a good cannon. I mean, it's far from being the most complex. I mean, it's just a simple little hybrid cannon. Works great for raiding almost any base. If you have any ideas for what kind of base or cannon I should make and use to raid any type of base that you want, just put it down in the comments below. So don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys later.